This book is called A Wolf at the Door. <clears throat> One quiet afternoon, while Father Bear was in the yard chopping wood, Little Bear sat reading his favorite book. All was cozy and peaceful when... Knock, knock, went the door. Who's there? asked Little Bear, jumping down from his chair. It's Billy, a tiny voice bleated. Please, let me in. Little Bear lifted the latch, opened the door, and in trotted... Little Billy Goat Gruff. Lock the door quickly, bleated Billy. A wolf is after me. And he shouted, come out, come out, wherever you are. I saw him up on the mountain, the little goat whimpered. I saw his long black shadow. He looked lean and mean, so I ran and ran until I got to your door. Little Bear sat Billy down. Don't worry, he said. You're safe here. And he started to read Billy a story. All was cozy and quiet when... Knock, knock, went the door. Who's there, called Little Bear. It's the Squealer Boys. Please, let us in. Little Bear lifted the latch opened the door and in trotted the three little pigs lock the door quickly they cried a huge wolf is after us he came to our house and he roared come out come out wherever you are he was fierce he was angry and he was lean and mean added billy we left our house and ran and ran until we got to your door squealed the three little pigs little bear let them in and locked the door don't worry, said Little Bear, you're safe here, and he sat them down to listen to the story. All was quiet and calm when, knock knock, went the door. Who's there, called Little Bear. It's Bo, said a voice, please let me in. Little Bear lifted the latch, opened the door, and in rushed. Little Bo Peep and all her sheep. Lock the door, cried Bo Peep, a wolf is after us. What happened, asked Little Bear, as he locked the door quickly. Down in the field, panted Bo Peep, I heard the hedge rustle, and I saw his bushy tail, and he bellowed, come out, come out, wherever you are. We ran for our lives, chorused the sheep, but he chased us. We could hear him panting, we could feel his hot wolfy breath. He was huge, bought the sheep, and he was fierce and angry, piped the pigs. He was lean and mean, bleated Billy, and we didn't stop until we got to your door, finished Bo Peep. So Little Bear sat them all down and started to read his story, but he kept being interrupted by a knock-knock at the door. First, there was Little Red Riding Hood, then Cinderella, and finally Goldilocks. They had all come to hide from the wicked wolf. Don't worry, Little Bear told them. You are all safe here. Father Bear came in from the yard. Goodness, he gasped. What are all your friends doing here? They've escaped from a terrible wolf, said Little Bear. He had eyes like fireworks and teeth like knives. He could gobble you up in one gulp. Just then, knock, knock, went the door. The house went very, very quiet. Father Bear slowly unlocked the door. Who's there? he boomed. Hello, I'm Wolfie. Can Little Bear come out to play? They all went out and played until bedtime. That was fun, said Wolfie afterwards. Come again soon, said Little Bear. Tomorrow, I'll bring my big brother. <laughs>